YouTube, what's good, y'all? It's your boy Quan. I am back with another vlog, and right now I am in the airport. And y'all may be wondering, Quan, where are you headed to? I am headed to LA because I have a big interview. So, with that being said, I'm gonna just spoil it right here, right now. I have an interview with No Jumper. So, when that video does indeed drop, I need y'all to go flood their comments with Cozy and show y'all. You know what I'm saying? It's cozy shit strong. So with that being said, we just made it through TSA and we are on the way to our gate. And yeah, I got Shaq with me. Two Hi kids. guys. You guys said that I don't be with the gang no more. You guys said I hate everybody. I don't know why I said that. <sighs> he been waiting to say that forever. Oh God, he been waiting to say that shit. They keep saying, wait, you don't fuck with Quan no more. I don't even see on the vlogs no more. First of all, Quan don't fuck with me. That's, that's, that's what? Just what? Everybody been working. We ain't twerking. SRT, SRT, SRT. All right, now. Hopefully y'all enjoy this vlog. I'm gonna try to make it more so cinematic than usual. Like, I'm gonna just try some. It's gonna be like testing waters. Because as y'all know, I don't really. S well, I take time editing. It takes me like three, four hours to edit a vlog. But I'm gonna try something a little different. So hopefully, y'all enjoy it. With that being said, let's get right into it. Yo, what's good, y'all? So we just made it into the American Express Lounge. And it's just gonna be some quick game for y'all folks. Cheat code to like this credit, my nigga. I'm in a lounge off of my credit. Unlimited free buffet. <laughs> this is fucking crazy. Look at these niggas. Boy, when I tell you this shit is smacking, boy. Y'all yeah, folks get y'all credit right, man. Get y'all some American Express and all things of that nature so y'all can do shit like this. Oh, I ain't even show y'all got a new, a new. Let's see that. That bitch tell like it came straight out of the toilet bowl. Yo, you is too OC for me, cuz. Man, listen. It's free. Let us hang out, gang with the pop out. Y'all probably like, Quan, what the hell your chain go? Nigga, snatch your shit? Hell nah. I put that shit up. Nigga, we in LA, I ain't stupid. <laughs> we were just talking this shit. We was like, um, what do hotels have the best of? Shaq said the bed. I said the, the towels. The towels in the hotels be like, they be rough, but they don't get wet. Like, no matter how wet you is, pause. Relax, bro. When you get out of the shower and you dry off, the towel does not be wet. That shit is crazy. I don't know what the fuck type, I don't know what they put in their towels. I don't know if it's just so much dirt in the towel that they don't clean it. I don't know, but that shit is amazing. This is nice. All right, man, I see the fit check fitted. There we go, uh, Lindsay on the toe. I already showed you the outfit, but yeah. Um, about to check in my hotel. I got bags under my eyes, but I'm gonna check in my hotel. Let me give y'all a tour of my room when I get there. So, let's do it. I'm liking this life. We on the 22nd floor, by the way. Let's see. All right, we on some fancy shit, you know what I'm saying? We on some fancy shit, all right. I forgot what room I even booked. I booked this shit so long ago. As soon as they hit me up for an interview, I just got everything out of the way. Cause I know if you book your flight earlier, it's cheaper. Then we just got up here quick as hell. Yeah, nigga. 22-17, nigga. Come get me, boy. Nigga, love. <laughs> okay, okay. Some slight view with a slight view of the city. It's kind of ashy right there, but it's cool, though. Alright, it's a, it's, a, it's a little vibe. It's a little vibe. Let's see what the bed look like, man. And, uh, okay. Alright, I'm rocking with it. I'm rocking with it. 
Oh, that's fancy as hell, cuz. And boy, your boy in LA with it, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you gotta do the, the test. Make sure they be at work for real. Yup, it works. How you, uh, it's a button? How you do this? Oh shit, what the fuck? <laughs> Damn, that's hard on oh, bro. That's hard. Cut housekeeping just brought me some some water. This shit say uh, Italy water. How's it that? That's that living room crib. This is where we living at, man. Nice little bathroom. The bathroom ain't connected to the bed. Damn, nigga. What's the, what the hell is this? Oh, the toilet. It's a glass door for the toilet, bro. That is crazy. That is overly crazy. This shit fancy as hell. What the hell? What a light switch is that? But I need to go get something to eat, so I just want to come put my bags down. I'm about to throw my phone in the charger for like I say five minutes, and then I'm about to head back out. I gotta go to Target because I forgot to pack t-shirts, and I need t-shirts. Damn, I ain't even see that though. You ain't even had to do it like that though. I just found the light, y'all. So now I have light, as you can see. All right, y'all, so we not in a sticky situation, but Target closes at nine o'clock and it is currently 8 23 so i just gonna went ahead and called the uber and i'm about to just head there hopefully i make it in time hopefully they're not like atlanta because when you in atlanta and you in target and they about time to close but i'm be yelling on the intercom they be like we about to close dude they say that shit every three minutes every two minutes just we about to close about to close about to close nigga i understood oh they got books in here might get on my reading shit today or tomorrow drop in the comments down below do y'all know how to read not do y'all know how to read, but do y'all actually like, do y'all read? I'm sitting right here letting my phone charge. Um, should, I, should, I take, should I take a shot before my interview? Hey, I don't know. I don't know how that's going to turn out. But they don't really got no good snacks. So we're going to go to Target and get Eats. And then that's really going to conclude this segment of the LA vlog. Mind you, I'm just doing one whole vlog for LA. So this will just be one long vlog. I'm going to try to keep it straight action. Before I do that. Let me uh get prepared for these LA streets. I'm gonna take that off, take this off, take this off. Nighttime in LA, won't be catching Quan down bad. So, we ain't got no jewels on, we good. Uh, I had popped these to go to sleep on the plane. And boy, when I tell you, that shit put me down, boy. I'm really rocking with this uh bag. It's like you, you dead, hold it just like this. Pretty cool, but no talking. Let's go ahead and go downstairs, Uber's here. I need to go to Paris so I can say uh, that line, niggas in Paris. Uh, Shawnee and Shaq, they got a different telly, like literally right up the block. But nigga, I'm just walking in the streets of LA. I think I want to take a solo trip next. Should we do that? Should I do that? Just take a trip by my dolly? I'd be paranoid as shit though. This nigga all the way over here, I just had to walk all the way across the fucking uh, spaceship. I haven't ate anything since. Don't leave, cuz. All right, y'all. As y'all can see, let's go to Target. Nigga, this shit is beautiful, cuz. I think that's the full hall she was talking about. The full hall? It's like, it's like 20 different stuff in there. Oh, they got five guys. Yo, this shit beautiful to the motherfucker, cuz. Target on Lord, this is where I'm from. <laughs> this shit look crazy. All right, I got you. All right, y'all, so they said I can't record, so I ain't gonna record till I get inside, cuz he ain't gonna be able to hey, tell me hey. not to record. <laughs> what I'm All right, y'all, so as soon as we, like, as soon as I cut the camera off, I took a picture with two people, nigga. Nigga, what the fuck, nigga? I'm in L.A. You're like, yo, that's Quan. Hell yeah, it's me, nigga. What the fuck? <laughs> that shit crazy. Yeah, what the fuck? I got to get some, uh, oh, shit, I got you. Stupid ass. I'm trying to go to the pool. Frick, do you really need <laughs> I need to get some swimming trunks, too. I don't even know how to swim. I can give me a swim cap. Man, look, man. If I just want to say I love and appreciate all y'all, bro. That shit just shocked me, like, nigga, I just got noticed in L.A. What, bro? What? I don't really be seeing it because I don't be nowhere, like, I just be in Atlanta. Nigga about to start crying and shit. All right, see you later, nigga. Just like that, man, we done made it back to the telly and quick story for y'all right quick. So we, we checking out a Target, woody woo, and we see a dude. And mind you, I'm not the dumbest nigga. 
So it's me, Shaq, Shani, yo. Cool. This nigga just keep looking at her. We like, oh shit, here we go. It's a crip nigga. Fuck. Why every time I come to LA, I, it's I always get a gang member uh, encounter. Why well, can't just be a civilian? Then I got this fat ass camera that don't make it no better, so I for sure look like a damn civilian. I mean, uh, uh, what's it called? A tourist. Whew. Boy, LA ain't for me, cuz. Oh, I gotta stop saying cuz. LA ain't for me, bro. This shit not for me, bro. All these niggas gangster. Nigga, I can't, I don't, I don't, you know what I'm saying? I know how to move and shit, of course, but this ain't my territory, so I don't know the ins and outs of this shit. I just know you can't wear hats that don't say LA if it's a color, and these gang members are fucking everywhere <laughs> now i got a quick uh story time about last time i was in la when we came and we was at a just breakfast spot in the hood but i'm gonna tell you when i get my food so when my food get here i'm gonna let y'all know that story but until then i will be back yo what's poppy y'all so it is not the brightest of the brightest but i'm still gonna eat my food and talk to y'all and i just got a, a crazy text message and while i'm out here in la while i'm out here in la i will be indeed going to look at a car and i didn't expect like this wasn't on my agenda for la but i just got sent a car i'm not gonna tell y'all the car I'm just gonna see what they talking about. If the number's right, I may potentially get the car. But I'm not gonna tell y'all until, like, if, it's, if, it, if I get the car, y'all obviously gonna see it. But if I don't get the car, we're just gonna sweep this under the rug, like, act like it never happened. So I got Popeyes and quick story time. So last time we was in LA, my, like I said, it's gonna be real quick, so I'm gonna just tell you this story so I can eat. But last time we was in LA, it was me, Ra, uh, Shaq, and my manager, Valeria. So. We came to LA on a business trip for Yale Yard, right? And it was the last day, it was our last day. Like, since we touched down to LA, we were just in and out of meetings, meeting, meeting after meeting after meeting. So, cool. The last day, right before we go to the airport, we like, okay, we just left our last meeting. Now we gotta head to the airport, but it's still fairly early, so we gotta go to breakfast. So, we head to this breakfast spot. I forgot who said, let's go there. Somebody said, let's go there. We ended up going there, and it was in the hood, my nigga. And as y'all know, I'm not from Atlanta. I'm from Atlanta, like, you know what I'm saying? So I don't really know too much of what's going on, but I know what's going on, you know what I'm saying? So we get in there, we uh, we get our food or whatever. So we had no problems up until it was time to go, my nigga. It was time to go. I get up, let me just break this down. So y'all gotta imagine this, y'all can close your eyes and visualize this shit. So, so you first walk in the door, it's tables to your left, it's tables to your right. And then you keep straight, it's the register and where you can order your food. So we we sit in right when you first walk in to the right. It's tables right by the door. So at the first table is Shaq, Ra, and my manager. And then I'm at the table, I'm at the table next to them like. So I'm at the second table close to the door. Cool. And I'm sitting like on two chairs with my feet kicked up on the other chair like this, eating my food, talking to them, eating my food, type shit. So boom, it's time to go now. And I get up to go pay for my food. Mind you, like I said, you first walk in, it's tables to the left, tables to the right. So, I keep saying this, but to the left, it's like, if you go further down the left, it's also the register where you pay it. So cool, I get my ticket, I go to go pay. When I, as I'm paying, mind y'all, I have my watch on. I forgot what watch I had on. So, mind you, bro, when you in LA, you not really supposed to wear jewelry, really not anywhere for real, unless you know where you at, like you know what's going on. And I don't know what the fuck going on. But I had on, uh, I don't know if I had on a long sleeve or a short sleeve, but the watch was visible, my nigga. So boom. A car tinted out pull up. I'm like, okay, I just peep it. It's a car pulling up. It's tinted the fuck out. But on the back window, it's like some kid shit. Y'all know like how I be having kid shit on the back of the window? Like some it was like some kid shit. So, boom. They pull up, they be tinted the fuck out. Everybody, I swear to God, this shit was like a movie scene. Every door swing open. Bim! Front door, back door, all door, all four doors open up. Bim! Okay, cool. I'm like, fuck! This shit really about to go down. Like. Nigga, I'm in LA. This shit about to get serious. So boom, a nigga hop out from each side of the car, each door that opened up. A nigga got out. So cool. I'm like, fuck. At this point, I see niggas getting out. Well, as soon as I seen the door swing open, I put my hand in my pocket, like deep as hell in my pocket. So you could not see my watch. So I'm standing at the register with my hand deep as fuck in my pocket, like flat as hell. So boom, I get my car back. I put it in my pocket. I'm walking back to the tables, and. At this point, they had already done walked in into the goddamn restaurant. So they all walk in. I swear, I kid you not, I swear this shit was like a movie, bro. Like, y'all gotta visualize this shit. So they get out of the car, boom, swing the doors up, and they walk in into the restaurant. It's four niggas, mind you, four niggas. So boom. Like, as soon as they walk in, it's like they just split ways. Like, they just all split up. And then one nigga, like, as soon as he walked in, he just stopped and he was just looking around, like, type of shit. So as he looking around, I mind you, I told you I'm walking back to the seats. 
So I had to walk right in front of this nigga because there's not much space from the door to where you order it. It's not a lot of space. So I had to walk right in front of this nigga. And he just looking me up and down. I, I kept a straight face because if I look at him and like on some shit, he gonna be like, oh, what this nigga on type shit? Like, what we about to do? We about to squabble up or what, cuz? Mind you, I, I'm, I'm about to stop saying that cuz shit. So, bro, yeah. So the, I'm walking past the nigga. He, uh, he say something like, uh, where y'all from, cuz? But he wasn't talking to us. But I thought he was talking to us because I had just walked past him and we sitting right here. It was another group of niggas in the back of the restaurant, like two tables down from me. Like it was four niggas in the back. He like, where y'all from, cuz? Bro, my heart, when I tell you my heart went to my ass, I'm like, man, fuck, man. I'm putting these niggas for the take my shit, bro. God damn. I'm lagging. So boom. He say that. I'm like, God, please. So I just sit down. I ain't say shit. When I sit down, like I told you, I was sitting like this. So I sit back down, I look, and then he looking at the niggas all the way over there. And they looking at him, and I'm looking at them looking at each other. And I'm just like, thank God if they ain't talking to us. So this is my cue to get the fuck up and get the fuck out. So me, Ra, and Shaq get the fuck up, fuck the food. We get up, because we had already, we basically done eating. We get up and walk out the black truck that we got is sitting right here by the fucking door. It's sitting right there. We walk outside, we get into the car. And one of the niggas walk outside. He like, he like, hey, or some shit, whatever the fuck they be saying. He be like, hey, mind you, Ra, his scary ass already in the car. He had to walk all the way around the car to get in the car. Shaq, he like in front of the car. I'm right here, cause I, I was in the back seat, like in the back seat, the back passenger seat. And we had back there park. So Ra went around, he ran around. Shaq, he in the front of the car. And I'm like right there by the door. And the nigga walk out, he like, hey, what the fuck is that noise? Uh, the nigga like, hey. I'm like, oh shit. So I turn around, like I, nah, bro, I'm kidding, I shit like a movie. I turn around, I'm like, shit, what's up? My job, like, I'm from Atlanta, so I'm like, I, I typically say, I be like, shit, what poppin'? But that's not good out here. You can't say shit like that. But that's like normal in Atlanta, like, shit, what poppin'? Like, what going on? So I got down, he like, intro the nigga from YouTube, cuz. I'm like, thank God, bro. This can either go real good or real bad, but I'm just thanking God. I'm like, shit, yeah. He was like, you be fucking with the clothes and shit. I'm like, yeah. He was like, that shit hard, man. Keep it up. I'm like, thank God. And mind you, when he said, hey, and I turned around, mind you, at this point, I'm like, y'all know how the black trucks got a little rail? I'm standing on the rail. Like, my door open. I'm standing on the rail type shit. I turn around. So if anything happened, I can just get down, close my door, lock that bitch. We good. Nigga, let go. Shaq, he, like I told you, he was in front of the car. But when the nigga said, hey, and I had to turn around because the nigga was talking to me, Shaq walked back. Like, because if shit pop off, Shaq, he good. Like, we good. Like, we, we might get our ass beat, but goddamn, we ain't going down without a fight. Right in the car with the seatbelt on already, goddamn, ready to go. Tell me why our manager is still in the fucking restaurant sitting down eating, my nigga. We in the car, like, what the fuck? Boom, oh, yeah, that was really that. I'm finna eat my food. I'll see y'all niggas tomorrow. And like I told y'all, it's a car that I'm going to look at. And if I do end up getting a car, y'all gonna see that vlog. I might come back out here to pick it up or I might get it transported to Atlanta. We gonna see. Just drop in the comments down below what car y'all think it is. And with that being said, I will see y'all tomorrow. Why am I saying YouTube? I already started my vlog. But what's going on, y'all? Good morning. I just woke up. Well, I ain't going to mean a lot of y'all. I actually woke up at like 6 in the morning because, as y'all know, LA time is three hours behind Atlanta time. So I'm three hours behind normal schedule. Needless to say, it's raining outside, bro. What are the odds of it raining when I come to LA? Don't it like never rain in LA? Like, this is so crazy. But my, um, my fit of the day, as y'all seen, I just threw on my fit. I got dressed. I got on this St. Michael's tee. I got on these spider um 
sweats and I got on some G Fazos, but it is raining and I'm not going to the interview just yet. Now I bought two, well I bought three outfits and I'm not sure what I want to wear to the interview just yet. And this was like the interview fit. I was just going to be on some comfortable shit, like some cozy shit. But should I actually put that shit on? Because I got that shit. But if I do put that shit on, I want to take pictures. And I can't take pictures in this weather. So I might just rock out with a comfortable fit. But before anything, what time is it? It is currently 9.42, as y'all can see. I'm about to head to this car dealership, like I said last night. Um. I'm not going to say anything about it on here. That will be a separate video if I do indeed end up getting the vehicle. But I'm about to start vlogging for that video just in case I do indeed get the vehicle. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, I will see y'all a little later and I will decide on what I will be wearing to the interview. Well, it's not an interview. It's a podcast. So with that being said, I'm about to just throw a jacket on and I will see y'all once I get back from the dealer. I'm gone. It was good, y'all. So I just made it back to the telly and y'all probably like, this nigga done got on a different outfit. So... I ended up changing them before I left. Let me show you what I did put on. I put on these black pants, some G Fazos, and this just because it is raining. I don't want to wear that shirt out in the rain. Interesting news with the vehicle. I'm not gonna lie, I've just been a lookout for a video, I guess you can say. But right now I'm gonna go ahead and order some room service and go to sleep because this time zone shit is fucking me up, bro. It's like it's so early out here, but it feels so late because I'm not used to this time. So with that being said, yeah, I'm about to eat. Go to sleep into the podcast. I'm going to actually decide what I want to wear when I wake back up. So I don't know if I'm going to wear this or not. I might do wear this though. Because it's like some cool, calm shit. Yo, what's good, y'all? So, Jay woke up and called my ride. Black truck on the way. And it's the fit I decided to go with. I got on that concrete shirt with these pants. My Lancy shoes. God told y'all I want to flick up, but it's raining. So, I ain't going to. Oh, shit. So, I ain't going to, you know what I'm saying, do the extra. But I'm going to throw this hoodie on. Because I do indeed got jewelry on. And we're going to get up out of here. So. So Quan bitch ass over there, and we got Shat bitch ass right there. Shat. Alright you All right, we finna watch some TV a little bit. Alright y'all, so we just wrapped up the podcast, you know what I'm saying? That was crazy, I ain't gonna lie. I just let some shit out that I ain't let out, that it needed to be let it out. Yeah, shout out Adam, shout out No Jumper. We in LA, bored as fuck, cuz I ain't gonna count to you. <laughs> we came to LA, it's like raining. It's raining, we... that's why we bored, bro. This is the podcast room, the legendary podcast room. Going boy Adam right here. Yeah, I just want to say I appreciate him. He showed love. Amazing Appreciate interview, man. Very motivational. I've been making content for a long time, so it's, it's dope to see like young dudes bringing new shit to the game. You know. For sure, I appreciate you. Just look at this setup, y'all. Let me know podcast soon. I don't know. We gonna see. I believe in you, man. There's a lot of ground that needs to be covered in Atlanta. There's a lot of strippers out there that I need to know about. <laughs> I need you to put in the legwork and find out. But I just want to say, like I said, I appreciate you again. Yo, for real, man. Gonna get up out of here. Yeah, appreciate you. Have fun in LA. If you need uh, any information or whatever, this shit you know. boring as fuck. LA? Yeah, it's this shit. It's because it's raining, though. I yeah, yeah, it is. The rain is depressing. Yeah. This oh, shit, shit bad. All right, y'all. So, like y'all just seen, I just want to say I appreciate y'all for getting me to the point to where I can do shit like this. And yeah, I got a vending machine with weed and stuff. How you feeling, bro? Bro, I feel like, you know, it becomes a point in your life. Well, like, wait, wait, wait. you see, cue the music. It comes a point in your life, right, where you see, like, you can vision yourself doing some things, mm -hmm. and some things just happen. Mm -hmm. This is one of them things that just happen, you feel know what I'm saying? Like, I remember, I remember being in high school watching this, and just to be here and experience this, it's a W, you feel know what I'm saying? Even though, like, bro, support, support your mans, bro. This is Quan's win right here. But you know, be here supporting them, you feel know what I'm saying? Like, what is it? this is, it, it, I feel like I just had an interview when I didn't. You know what I'm saying? But just seeing yeah. it on the big screen, like, you watch, watch it right there. Yeah. Seeing it, you just watch it, bro. Be sure on tune like this. You like, feel me, though? Like, <laughs> nah, nigga said, bro, this nigga really said some shit. Niggas ain't know, bro. Oh, yeah. yeah. His partners ain't know. He said some shit. I'm like, he said that. I'm like, first time, like, bro. <laughs> I said, damn, niggas are scamming my boy. I said, he's scamming, but he got scammed. Okay. Like, tighten up, my nigga. 
Them two artwork right there, they're my favorite part. Juice and X. Yeah, that shit is tough. Yo, he, don't, he don't get Juice World. Yeah, you know Juice World? I don't know him. Juice World, I ain't gonna lie. Come on Dude, now. Juice World, so Juice World, he talented as much. A legend. Try, try and get high. Niggas fucked up the camera, hey, cow. Stupid. Uh, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. LA is a full of thugs. Niggas walking around handing out weed like there's nothing. Uh, I ain't getting nothing. I got one weed, y'all. I'm gonna oh, show y'all. Well, I can show y'all. It's legal out here. He gave me one weed. Should I, should I get a vlog? A high vlog? Nah. <laughs> yeah, nah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna go sell this shit, cuz. You can sell weed out here, right? Nah, you better not. Oh, man. I got that Zion. <laughs> Hey, cuz y'all want that? So I got that on me now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alright, so I'm currently waiting on my ride, but like I was telling y'all, bro, that shit crazy. Like, y'all, nigga, we are family, right? So if I'm on no jumper, y'all niggas on no jumper. So y'all gotta look at it like this, like, nigga, we cozy was just on no jumper as a family, bro. Like, bro, this shit crazy. This may not be the biggest shit to y'all, but to me, it's like. I, like, like Shaq said, bro, I grew up watching this shit, though. I just want to say, like, that shit cool as hell. But we went on our ride, and uh, today we might not get into nothing else because it's raining. It's, it's, been, it's going to be raining every day we out here. I leave tomorrow night. But tomorrow, we will vlog. We do a little shopping and whatnot. Go pick up a little pieces, and I'm going to just vlog the rest of my day tomorrow. Like, it's going to be more so uncut footage tomorrow because, as y'all know, this ain't really been nothing. It has been me traveling here and me being here and me doing a little shit. But now it's we about to get really get into the nitty gritty. So tomorrow, we're gonna try to make the best of what we can. Type shit. It was good, y'all. Listen, next day and right now my breakfast just came as I can see. Let's give it a little rating. Let's see what we got. Damn, that shit look. Uh, Pleasing. Okay, all right. All right. Hey, this is probably the the best um room service I done had. Like they come up here, they set it down on the table. Then when you done eating and you ready to go, you just click this button. You click that button right there. They come pick up your tray. That shit is crazy. I'm gonna eat, then I might, and I'm gonna go ahead and start getting dressed and shit. But like I said once again, yeah. it's raining, bro. My since I landed here, it's been raining. I guess that was just a sign for me to not be outside. But today we're gonna go do a little shop and see what we can find. And yeah, I'm finna eat this food and I will get up with y'all once I'm dressed. So I be bet. Yeah, I think it's about that time to get my my chest tatted because it's gonna be summertime. And I've been wanting to get my chest tatted for a minute. I just been procrastinating about it. But I got the arm tats. I just need the you know what I'm saying. The chest tat. So that's coming soon. I might book my appointment when I get back to the city. Quick question. Just a real quick question. What car would y'all pick? Let me sit down right quick. What car would y'all pick for content purposes, right? Would y'all go Demon or would y'all go yours? Let me know, drop in the comments down below. If you was a content creator, what kind of car would you pick? It was good, y'all, so I just got dressed and I ain't gonna lie, bro. All the outfits I packed, well, one of the outfits I'm gonna flick up in when I get back to the city because I ain't gonna waste a fit on the rain. But it's like, I done packed some Steve's outfits and it's just raining, like, I ain't, you know what I'm saying? I wasn't planning on it to be raining out there, motherfuckers, though. I'm just rocking out with the same pants I had on yesterday. So I can't see. Those like shoes, different hoodie. But yeah, this just is the attire for the day, just because it's raining. And niggas' clothing options is limited. But we're gonna go ahead and do a little shopping. Um, I wanna go to the store I went to last time when I was in LA, where I got this jacket from that everybody was asking me about when I posted on Instagram. See if they got some more pieces. And I wanna go to Vivian S. Wood and get smoke earrings because if y'all don't know these are the earrings i be wearing like damn near every day i got another pair i just don't wear them. but i want to see if they got some different shit in style and stock all right y'all i'm headed down right now and it's crazy because for the first time where I, i've traveled i'm genu genuinely ready to go home it's, it's just this rain like it's just fucking up the vibe like you can just sitting in the crib all day it rained and gloomy as hell like i'm trying to see some sun some sunshine, you know what I'm saying? They got in my hotel like a fucking uh, hot rise. Oh, this what it look like. I don't know where the truck is. I'm about to go see. But is it weird for um for people to get in the elevator y'all don't say nothing to them? Oh, they around the street. I gotta walk around the street. I'm gonna tell them to come around the valet because it's raining. Am I whispering, y'all? Do I need to talk up? <clears throat> 
Shit, what about that guy lie? But yeah, uh, is it weird to not talk to or say anything when somebody walks in the elevator? Like, are you obligated to say something to every to a person when they walk in the elevator? <clears throat> because I don't really be saying shit. I feel like I'm, I don't know, bro. I'm like socially awkward, bro. I don't be knowing what the fuck to say or like how to engage into the conversation. I don't know. I gotta walk back up here because I can't walk up. Can't jump over that shit. All right, y'all. So my hair all out of shit, but it's raining, my nigga. Bad. We just made it into cool kicks. As y'all can see around this bitch. Y'all probably seen this shit all on the internet. And some other shit. Hold on. These niggas in this bitch hooping. What the hell? <laughs> y'all got the um door breaker four in a eight and a half? That's a ten. What's up? Video, Word, appreciate you. Ten and a half. Ten and a half. Damn, that's too big. Size uh, eight and a half, nine. Yeah. All right, y'all. So, like I said, we just made it a cool kick. See what they got. I, like I told y'all, I came here to. You fold it? No. You fold it? Why not? Drop in the comments down below. Y'all fold. I feel like this is a slight shoe, but I don't know though. I came in this bitch to see. Hey, Bob McGann, you good? Love, bro. Are you acting a bit with you? Yeah, let's do it. All right, let's do it. Nice to meet you, bro. Thanks again. The shoe I'm looking for is them DB4s, y'all. I got a, I got a bone to pick with them bitches. The store that I originally came here for, it's right next to Cool Kicks. They closed that bitch down, so we ain't need, you know what I'm saying? You fuck with them? Nah, I can see weird in these those. Me? Yeah. That's some Wolfie shiny old ass shit, bro. I can see Wolfie wears some shit, though. Talking about that's some shiny shit. You don't think that's some Utah shit? Nah, I ain't gonna lie. I don't see me. I don't see me. No, nah, shit, that that was going on. Shaq, we got Kwan in the building. We got Kwan in the building. Tell my boy Shaq, I so, say yeah, what's up. up. That is crazy. Oh, nah, streaming on the Shaq. What's wrong, boy? What's up? Nigga, they on stream in the store and yeah, motherfuckers yeah. like, is that Kwan? Yeah. That's crazy. They got good ass prices, too. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, bro. What the green ones? That's a 10. That's too big. I got every color except for the green one. Sheesh! The rain! Good. What the fuck? Hmm? <laughs> this nigga's just shitting on this. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga's just shitting on this. Oh, uh, can we go? He said three blocks up. It's Next, called the cool. It's right by Foot Locker. Bro, he, 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 he bought a cigarette. Oh, bro. I ain't mad at you, Tim. I'm with the bundle split too. Cause ah, you got, we just got, bro, we just got notice in Cool Kick. That on, is the crazy. on the stream. On the stream. And by the by the by the by the, by the supporters too. That is yeah. In, in LA. In L that is crazy. Yeah, we thousands of miles away from the stream is crazy. What? They're talking about what the fuck is that Quan? <laughs> we got motion. What the fuck? Y'all, it's like when I was on that podcast, bro, it was like I forgot to say one thing about how niggas be trolling me. They be like they didn't get their order the whole time they ain't order shit. Let me show y'all actually. I ain't get I order either. You didn't get your order yet? You ain't order, bitch. I know. Hold on. I got a, I got a picture, bro. <coughs> I did screenshot of this shit. You I, people, you people, they got, the, they got the, um, the cozy sweaters on TikTok shop. Yeah. They <laughs> <laughs> like said I was trying to wait for my uh, hoodie, so I ordered on a TikTok shop. That shit look frail as hell. That shit, <laughs> shit was a boneless. boneless hoodie. <laughs> oh god, they got a boneless cozy hoodie. Yeah. <laughs> Let me show y'all this shit, bro. Let me crop it so the Instagram end don't show. But this nigga posted on his story and was like. Some fuck shit. He was saying something about something. I ain't get my jacket. Da, da, da. I've been waiting 30 years and shit. Look at this shit. Nigga said. Can y'all see this? I won't tell I DM'd him. I was like, order number? He talking about I was joking. WDM. You niggas need to grow the <laughs> fuck up. You, 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 you stupid dumb bitch. I ain't gonna lie. Nah, but y'all gonna see, I got some crazy shit on the way. Y'all gonna be like, damn, damn, everybody gonna be dick run. They gonna go from dick sucking to dick run. Like, Welcome to America. Walking to a fucking America is crazy. Niggas just support whatever everybody else supporting. But now we gotta go to the front, cause it's the store next to it. He just told us that it was by the Foot Locker. That's what I told you. Right All right, y'all, so we just made it to the next spizzy. It's called The Cool. It's currently fucking raining. But we're gonna see what they're talking about up in here, see what they got. Maybe pick up a few items and shit. What's poppin'? This shit cool. 
Yeah. It's the African man. Yo. Bitch, the fuck y'all ain't answer y'all phone. I know y'all ain't got no motion. But you crazy as fuck. This nigga missed us. What pop? What motion y'all got, nigga? Nigga, we just outside, nigga. What you talking about? Man, you lying. I know, nigga, I know you lying when you say some dumb ass shit like this. Nigga, look. Oh, you can't see. Where y'all at? Nigga, y'all at cool kicks. Y'all ain't doing a fuck thing. We just got here. We just got out. He called you because he bored his shit. Yeah, he, he bored. You, he called you because he bored his shit. He bored. He bored. He bored. First of all, we're at the cool, not the cool kicks. Nigga, y'all ain't got, nigga, y'all ain't, that ain't a trip if I ain't tripping, nigga. Hey, hold on, hold on, you hoe calling? Dude, he don't got a nigga boy, this shit walking in Target ain't buying a fucking thing. All right, y'all, so we is leaving the Vivian Westwood store. And they said we couldn't record, so I ain't record. I wanted to respect the, you know what I'm saying, community and whatnot. But I picked up me some new earrings. Vlog, bro, can y'all see that? Nigga, we is really in GTA. If y'all know in GTA, that's the ramp. Like, it's like a ramp. In the middle of the, yeah. In the middle of the shit. And then the, the barbershop is down that street. Mm -hmm. I used to do the invisible glitch over there. You said what? I used to do the invisible glitch over there. This shit is crazy. This is really GTA body. Yo, what is this nigga doing? What the fuck? Nah, he got mad. Yo, cuz, you good? Yo! Alright, All right, y'all. So, we is on Beverly Hills. I see a fucking Urus. Damn body. I need me to fucking you this body. Nigga, we really walking in GTA, cuz. It's a line to get in the go yard, sir. So we're gonna wait in this line, but. Nigga, we in GTA, cuz. We in ATG? So I wonder if I just kill somebody, they'll come back to life. Nah, this still real life, cuddy. <laughs> Fuck wrong, nigga. Um, I don't believe I can record in here, so I'm gonna show y'all what they got. I'm gonna show you what I pick up after I come out. But yeah, y'all see this shit? What's your channel? Uh, Quan? Q U I N N? Q U A N. Alright, yeah, my goal while I was out here was to see a Tesla Cybertruck. I have not seen one yet. The most expensive car I've seen so far is a uh, Urus. I ain't really seen. Oh yeah, I did see a Venador. I seen a Venador and a, and a SF90. No, that was an F8. A F8 Tributo. I seen two of them. I never actually seen a Bugatti on the street though. Are Bugattis more common in LA or at Miami? Seen them in Miami, but they was at the dealership. All right, y'all. So we just. Got a couple items out of Go Yard as I can't see the nice, beautiful store back. Um, I'm walking out and the nigga told me, Congratulations. The nigga said, Congratulations, boys, we got him. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that means, but if y'all want some oh, Go Yard, man. Oh shit, this is Mopar. That's a V6. I ain't really see no Mopars out of this bitch since I've been out here. Yeah. I, that's real life, some Atlanta shit. What's down there? Um, we're gonna take your booty, you put on there. Popeyes! <laughs> you ain't gonna, gonna turn into a Popeye, cuz. I had Popeyes yet. Hey, what's that? What's that? Um, I go to the spot you was talking about. Oh, Boston over? These niggas on a tour. What the fuck? All right, y'all. So we finna go get some eats, bro. Buying Goyard from the actual Goyard store is a thousand times better than paying resale for that shit, bro. All right, y'all. When I get back to Atlanta, I need for any and everybody to get the word out that Quan is trying to learn how to do donuts, but I want to learn how to do it legally. I want to learn how to slide my car. So if you in Atlanta and you own some type of land where I can practice doing sliding, let me know. Georgia, bro. Georgia, if you're in Georgia, I will drive to you. Well, I don't got no chance to better drive to you. It hit me too, cause that nigga don't be answering his DMs sometimes. Nah, for real though, DM one of us on Instagram. Cause S if you overlook that shit, that's the opportunity to go. SRT Shiny Yo, uh, Cozy Fleet on Instagram. And yeah, I'm be looking, cause I wanna learn how to, I wanna learn how to slide. And y'all been begging to see my Hellcat rap, bro. Do y'all really wanna see that shit? Do y'all really? Like, should I just drop the video for y'all so y'all can shut the fuck up? Because once y'all see it, y'all just gonna stop asking about it. But if y'all don't see it, y'all gonna keep asking about it. So I might not show y'all just so y'all keep asking about it. Oh shit, it's the police station. They got this same police station on GTA. Cuz, this is really, they need to make a GTA in Atlanta, bro. Where is, can you take us to Eclipse Towers, cuz? Well, y'all, do y'all see that shit, bro? Continue on Sunset Nigga, that's Eclipse Towers, cuz. Damn, what the fuck? Y'all see that shit, bro? Yeah. Yeah. Damn, this the same road. That is crazy, bro. It looks just like this, my nigga. What the fuck? No, that, that was, was crazy. So that was crazy. I ain't gonna count. You just don't go what? all the way out there trying that. That was crazy, man. Right? What the fuck? The man that come out this nigga, boy. Ain't no way. What? What you trying to say, cuz? <laughs> hey. What? This nigga, bro. 
Don't let me tell y'all about Shani, yo. You got it. Uh oh. Bro. And Shaq. Hmm? Nah, 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 don't, see, hmm. nah, you tripping. Nah, man. nah, what you, you, you niggas you don't, you go jump out there saying, man. niggas don't want to know the real, okay? Niggas start saying anything. I'm telling the truth. Look, check me out. What's the truth? So I go knock on these niggas' hotel room. <laughs> God, I hear God. clapping. Man, God, hell no. I open the door, Shaq twerking. <laughs> what you, what the? Bro, how you get in the hotel, hotel, hotel room? What? You get in the hotel key to get upstairs. Why you, why you looking at him like that, girl? <laughs> bro, you be lying for fun, bro. Man. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking somebody in there clapping. I walk in there, Shaq twerking. Right, Shani, you're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, beat it. That was less sexy, right? right? Look, we is really in the trenches, cuz. West side, cuz. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm just playing. I'm not a thug. I'm not a gangster. I am a bitch. Uh, we finna go in and eat. I don't want to be recording all these people and shit. So I'm gonna go start recording when I sit down, cuz I don't know how niggas get out here with the whole vlog and shit. But shit, fuck it, nigga. I'm cozy, nigga. Let's do it. I just don't want a nigga to run by and take me. All right, y'all. So we just made it to the restaurant. Um, I don't know if this shit gonna be good or not. We are gonna let Shaq. Well, hopefully it's good. Shaq told us to come here, so if it's bad eats, we just gonna get the punching on it. Mind them wicked, but me wicked than them. them. All right, y'all. Just like some quick insight on this whole LA trip. So I came here for the podcast, cool. But I wanted to like explore the area and shit, you know what I'm saying? But niggas ain't being able to do that because it been raining every goddamn day and shit. Like cats and dogs been falling out of the sky. Nigga, nigga, I'm, I'm, I'm asleep and I hear banging on the window. I open the window, it's a crib, nigga, cuz. I closed the curtain and went back to sleep because I don't really get into that gangbanging shit. Niggas be out here gangbanging hard. I don't be gangbanging and shit. I just be civilized Christianity, you know what I'm saying? All the other ass shit. Count me out. Like I said, when No Jumper dropped that podcast, I need y'all to flood them comments, nigga. Flood them comments with cozy, 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 yeah. But we gotta come together and like be be that that group. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like niggas know this cozy shit run deep. Yeah, but like simple syrup is just sugar and water. You know what I'm saying? It's not like I can add more if you want. All right, y'all, I ain't gonna lie, Shaq ain't steer me in the wrong direction, but this shit look good as hell. Look at this shit. Look at this shit, cuz. Damn. It's always that one nigga that don't get his food, cuz. No. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna eat. I ain't gonna eat. I ain't gonna eat. I ain't gonna eat. But look, though, y'all, look. I'm finna... I ain't gonna lie. Every time you see you want food, you start to eat. <laughs> yeah, he do. He, he don't he be do waiting on niggas. Look, though. I'm gonna uh, drop these pictures on Instagram. Y'all go follow me on Instagram. I'm trying to get to a million followers. I'm almost there, so. Yeah, but. Craziest flicks, my nigga. Them bitches are stupid. But I'm gonna fuck this food up. You hungry? <laughs> Pussy. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, dinner is done. I'm full as shit. I ain't gonna lie. That food was the best food I ever had in two days. Like, I've been eating Popeyes on DoorDash. Hey, maybe get some fresh air. I ain't gonna lie, cuz. I do wanna drive by the pier at least one time, like, in that area. Where, how far is that shit? The pier? Santa, Santa Monica Boulevard? How, want, far, how far is it? Well, like, GTA's oh, that's like an hour and a half. An hour and a half? Bullshit. You cap. Bro, on GTA, that shit right up the street from here. Oh, God, that shit right <laughs> Hello, cuz. Oh, man. That's a little CLA 45. From right here, 35 minutes. Santa Monica Pier? Gotta get a driver some more money. How much you charging? 100 hours. How much you get so far? Two hours. Yeah, that two hours up. <laughs> we need to <laughs> we need to hit the ATM or something, cuz. I'm gonna ask him, do you wanna keep driving? For the kid. You know what I'm saying? Put y'all on game, y'all. Y'all need an Uber. You ask the driver to drive for you for the day and you just pay him. So you don't gotta keep calling Ubers when you're traveling. Pro tip. Alright y'all, so we was just in a black truck driving to our next destination, but I seen these pants in the window and I gotta go see what they're talking about. I told the driver, cuz, stop this bitch, cuz. Let me go see what that drip time I like. I literally looked up, and as soon as I looked up, the pants was looking at me, and I was looking at the pants, and the pants was like, "Come put it on me." Look at what I'ma do. Put it on you. Uh, hopefully they they men jeans or pants. I don't think it was jeans. I think it was like, I don't know. They they look like nylon from what I seen throughout the window. But nigga, I'm in Beverly Hills. I ain't in Beverly Hills. Yeah, I'm in GTA car. They like a female costume. Is this a female store? I think this is a female store. 
I think it's a female store, cuz. Yeah. Look, yeah, let me show y'all. This a female store? Oh, what is that? The next door. Next door? Alright, cool. Nigga, them pants crazy. Let's see if they got something like that for the men's. I literally said I hope it's not a men's store and we walk in that bitch and it's a men's store. Alright y'all, so I ain't gonna lie. No, that shit's hard. I ain't gonna lie. Them pants are hard as shit. 1600? Yeah. Statement piece pieces. Shit. But what do you do you do you do you <clears throat> Those are some dark shadow bricks? What? Nah, them pants is old. Crazy. Nah, they got some pieceries. Hey, I just bought these. I just bought the black one. That's crazy. I bought one of them yesterday. Yeah, this, this is my Steve's right here. This is my Steve's right here. Oh, my fault. That's a that's you. The, if anything in here is you, is that? It's like some that with those pants you got on right now, and some big old fat ass black black canadas. Some black boots. That jacket's tough. That's a great piece. Oh, the price out on this boots. Man, listen, man. This is like some. It don't matter what it costs. Go ahead, get it, baby. <laughs> man, I'm trying. I'm trying to buy. Uh, I'm saving up for this for this land. Hello. Good morning. W leak, W leak. You gotta come, you gotta come in here with like a hundred thousand already to spend. They got some feederies too. Yeah, you, you look who's on top. Yeah. Yo! I ain't gonna lie, cuz. The ones on top look fake pain. I just bought these before I left. Elite's forces. Y'all think it's a W shoe? Nah, I thought. Uh, can I see the shoes at the top? What is this? It's a fat ass bubble. It's denim 46. These are crazy. Imagine these, but with the black top. With the hoodie you got on right now. Yo, what are these? Exactly. And they only $500? Exactly. Oh, they got the mask. Nah, I just, I literally just ordered this shit last night, bro. Can y'all see this? And they didn't have this one, so I'm gonna pick this one up, because they ain't had this one. Dude, this is crazy. I just fell in love with this store. What is this? This is my store. This for show my new store. When I'm in LA. What the fuck? I got a loaf of bread. The tan John? You know how you get. Nah, I, they got the blue one too. I gotta see which ones I ordered. I'm finna buy every one I didn't order. Oh, bro, I am. How much they want for him though? Let me go see. Cause I did as I was in the hotel last night and I ordered them. I'm finna see what I ordered. Whatever I ain't order, man, I'm finna buy. But nah, LA? I fuck with LA. I'm gonna be back out here next week. Big love. They got some shit, boy. I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna fit all this shit in my shit, but okay, let me show y'all. I got the red mask and the blue mask. So all I need to get is the black mask, which is this one. How much they want for it? 905? Fuck. I'm gonna get it though because online it was sold out. Yeah. What they mean, right? You got to get it. Yeah, this this is for show cop. I just farted. That bitch smell like death. It's like some real deal, like step of shit, nigga. What? You do a challenge, right? Uh-huh. You get like three, four of your friends. Uh-huh. And then Make them, we all go to the store, uh -huh. and we style you. Right. And whichever outfit you like the best, that person wins, and that person wins the outfit. That person wins the outfit? Wins the outfit. Wins outfit. Okay, cool. That might be something smart for the uh, for the fashion shit. For the, for the, yeah, yeah. I don't know what the hell paying for all that shit, but hey. Who would think of something like that? The niggas in Milan. Where the fuck is Milan? Paris. I need to go to Paris, bro. No cap. And they got all your sizes out there. So they, they only wear 28s on that motherfucker. Cause everybody's skinny as shit. Mm-hmm. Damn. Nigga, this store, bro. Pain. Uh, a warning? Nah, cause it was reflecting. It was oh. black. I thought it was this, but black. That's outside. This all. They got some great pieces in here. Nihara, Capital. This like shit you ain't gonna see, bro. Yeah, you gotta be in the store to see these. What's that? I don't 
light is color. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, I ain't get jiggy with this shit. That's yeah. a fat ass jiggy. All right, y'all, so we finna go downstairs with it. So y'all can see. They're having more pieces. If you like smaller size stuff, there's also this right here. And it's just crazy shit. I got this right here called Earthling. Earthling? They do crazy shit. Look at this. Nah, that, that is with, tough. With the crop vest. Nah, they got some pieces. Do y'all see this? Nah, that's crazy. I'm gonna take a look around down here for sure. Yeah. Damn. Even, even, look, at, even look at this color. Mixed for a shirt. Yeah, see that? It's beautiful. Nah, that is tough. Let me see this jacket though. Yeah, take your time for Brown jacket. I know brown is my color, man. You like brown, yeah? Yeah. This puffer, this puffer goes crazy. The brown and black goes crazy. Same, same design. What size is these brown pants? Uh, I got sizes if you like. Oh, it's not big at the bottom, though. Nah, I don't know. I'm you good. like more folded? Yeah. yeah. It's like overwhelming how much shit they got in here. Everything, any, any kind of flip you're looking for. Literally. Yeah. They have everything from this to that. Let's see this. It's like a type of vibe. You pop out. Just trying shit. Just trying shit. Oh, <laughs> bro. You gotta see what those guys wearing out. I got them. Yeah. I just know they weren't out for us. So. That's crazy. But this is hard. These are all complete one on ones. Where? The price point's pretty good with the crystals, right? Like 300 something. Yeah. That's a large. Yeah, they're more than I mean, I gotta go get tatted. Pop out. You got your chest and shit. Yeah, your chest and shit. It's like on some survival beanie, shit. Beanie. But that, look, that beanie, it give, it looked like I thought it was Supreme. Cause you know Supreme did that score shit. Mm -hmm. It's like Supreme. And then the back looked like Chrome with the with this. Mm -hmm. You ever seen that black and red Chrome? I'm gonna dedicate a LA trip just to shopping. And this is the store that I will be in. This whole store cool as hell. The aesthetic to the pieces they got to this to that. Nigga, they even got glasses. Crazy. I don't have one to fit today. I just had to throw what I had in the fucking suitcase. Cause it's rain shit. Yeah. How are you? Pete. Hello? How Ooh. are you? I better watch all them ads. Nigga. So can you explain to me what what you were talking about the t-shirts? Every ad. Or both. Okay, so I'm gonna tell y'all, I'm finna hit that million on Instagram. Appreciate you, bro. Appreciate y'all. Christian, add another photo strip. Okay. Alright, appreciate y'all. You guys have a good day? Alright, you too. I don't know where I'm gonna put this shit. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm gonna make it work. We're gonna, when we get back to the telly, we're gonna force this shit to work. The driver ain't leave us, thank God. Let me take a picture of this store. Talk I, about thank God, nigga, if he would have left, our shit in there. I gotta come back. Yeah, but it's actually done. Nigga, even the front of the store is a flick spot. Like, I see, yeah, man. I'm back out here, bro. I don't know when I'm back out here, but I'm back out here. I'm finna start dropping vlogs. So, yeah, uh, yeah. Damn, nigga. So let me tell y'all. So we was in a black truck, like I said, and that specific piece caught my eye. Kinda found out that's the woman's store, but they got a man's store right next to it. And we went in there, and they, you know what I'm saying? Having that shit. Fuck that beer. I, nigga, I, lo I love LA. But this shit crazy. Yeah, I just caught up the drip. Ah, we vlogging nonstop now. We just spent some money on. <laughs> That's hard. It's like I just told what you call it, a photo stream. Uh -huh. Whereas I think it's some shit like you're gonna be able to see what's coming in when they come in. Damn, I see when you go spin that bag in certain areas, they, they fuck with you, man. <laughs> they probably like, damn, I'm and they, they see you working too at the same time, so they're like, okay, cool, he got something going on. Oh, bro, damn. They probably like, damn. Mm -hmm. motion, motion. Damn. Y'all folks, man, quick motivation. Uh, My forehead big, but I'm doing good in life. The pocket's bigger, Gerard. Yeah, the forehead <laughs> big, but the pocket's bigger, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Work for everything you got and got them. Keep God in your life, fuck boy. It's like, I want some real shit. Y'all probably like, bro, this nigga always just be yapping, but it's real shit. Like, I'm trying to get an hour long vlog, but I'm still yapping, like, to let y'all niggas know some real shit. Like, y'all folks gotta pray for everything you got mm -hmm. and pray for everything you don't got. Mm -hmm. Like, shit gonna work out. Like, nigga, I'm in GTA right now.
outside, driving in the back of a truck. See how they like, because <clears throat> we in GTA, we consider pedestrians. Low key. Like, All right, we back. Back to what we were saying. Who the fuck is the main characters out here right now? Because it's, it's probably billionaires walking across the street, walking down the street right now, and we don't have no clue. That shit is crazy. The beauty of life. Never just a book by its cover. Cause a oh. motherfucker could be sitting right next to you, and he he or she is worth what, what's after trillion? Zillion? Is there has there any ever been any zillionaires? Mm. Uh, they probably some. Masa Musa. Who the fuck is Masa Musa? The richest person yeah. ever to live. He African. He was African. He, he's black. Yeah, Masa yeah, Musa. Yeah. He was so rich, bro. He went through like the poorest part of like I think like Egypt or like somewhere in Africa. Uh -huh. He was giving away gold to the people. That it, like it, like it made their whole economy fail because like you know gold back then was like the like economy. Yeah. He went and gave mad gold to all the poor people. What so now like gold meant nothing to them no more because like, everybody had gold. Yeah. Damn. He was that rich. That boy say top flow, fit your flow, you know about that. <laughs> Boy, 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 boy. This is what a $10,000 in LA shopping spree look like. I'm finna go ahead and sit down and show y'all everything that I got. And before this video drop, when I get home, the same day I get home, which is tomorrow morning, I'm gonna be streaming. So my stream seen it first. So y'all folks gotta go subscribe to the Twitch and follow the Twitch. It's I-P-A-P-P-I-I-Q. But let me go ahead and show y'all what we rocking with and I got to pack all this stuff up so let's go ahead and go in the room so first place I went to well none of this is in order but we got Vivian Westwood if y'all don't know what Vivian Westwood is is these earrings I'm always wearing I went ahead and caught me some more earrings because I got these same earrings last time when I was in LA from the same spot so they gave me like this cool just like a I guess you could say a souvenir it's like a little Vivian Westwood fan just for shopping in there. They had like some little shit going on, I guess. But that's that. And I got two items up out of here, as y'all can see. Boom, let it focus, cuz. There we go, as y'all can see. But let's see what I got. So we go, uh, that's what the packaging look like. Yo, authentication card. It come with like a little um, authentication card. Y'all can see, this is how they be doing on them little uh, review, review Instagram, review YouTubes. And then the actual item comes in like this little bag. Then the earrings, I was having some focus issues, but I don't know if y'all can see that. It's like a slight shit, you know what I'm saying? But got these pair of earrings and I got another pair of earrings. Let me show y'all, boy, all right, quit, man, with the whoop, the whoop. Ain't no motherfucking way. There's nothing in here. Dude, you dead ass. <laughs> they done got me, cuz. What the fuck did I buy? I bought a pair of earrings. What else did I grab? It was two items. I think it was two pair of earrings. They put this clear bag over because it was raining outside. So, and the, this is probably the best shit because y'all know it's. They don't have Goyard stores everywhere, so if you want some Goyard, you're going to have to pay resale unless you come to like LA or New York. Um, I'm not sure if they got one in Miami, but yeah, so this is that. I'm about to show you what I picked up up out of here. And I can't bring this bag because I don't really got space on my shit in my suitcase and whatnot. But what I did indeed end up picking up. Now, if some shit in here that's not in here, if my shit ain't in here, I'm finna go back up there. I'm finna walk back up there, nigga. Okay, ain't no way. But we go, uh. Oh, like I was saying, so it's only Goyard in LA and New York, and I'm not sure if it is in Miami, but yeah, so when you come to places like this, you gotta, if you want your shit, you gotta get your shit, because if you get, if you pay resale, bro, you taxing, like they be taxing. So as y'all know, I got that bag that I showed y'all earlier. I've been rocking. So I went in and got a card holder to match it, as y'all can see. Great cop, you know what I'm saying? 
Not only did I get a card holder, but I did indeed snag a wallet. So now I got the whole like, you know what I'm saying, little set. This is my first ever wallet. I don't really like wallets. I'm hip to card holders, but I was like, why not just add a wallet to the collection? You know what I'm saying? And then last but not least, we got, let me show y'all folks. Just like my gray bag, I got a yellow one. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, this is that. I'm about to, uh, and I got some clothes. I got to show y'all the clothes. Let me show y'all the clothes. So I got this hard ass uh, mask, but it's also a bag. And like I said, it's so crazy because I had just ordered the shit last night, like from the website, the stuff that I seen that I wanted. But yeah, it's like a bag. You can rock it like a bag or you can wear it like a mask. Now, me personally, I might not wear it as a mask. I mean, as a bag. I'm more so going to wear it as a mask because that's just like my whole point of purchasing it. But I also copped a couple accessories out of there too. Let me show y'all. I got this Capital Wallet, which y'all can see. This shit fight as hell, I ain't gonna lie. Boom! Then I got, I, I believe it was like a, it's like a, a bracelet. Let me show y'all. Got this hard ass bracelet. So I can see. Yeah, so that, that. Uh, next, let's see. I got this tough ass jacket, bro. Like, nigga, this shit is crazy, bro. This shit's crazy. I think this jacket was like two racks or something. This bitch dumb though, like, over me. Then I got these hard ass pants. So I can see they're like some leather john, you know what I'm saying? Then, last but not least, I got these other pants. You know what I'm like some trap type pants. And yeah, that's my ten thousand dollar shopping spree in LA. And next time I come to LA, I'm gonna bring a. Uh, I might not pack nothing. I might just go shop. I, that's always. That's what. I, that's like a goal of mine. I always want to do it. I always wanted to go somewhere and travel, not pack no bag, just go hop on the plane, come out here and shop, and then bring all the shit back home. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I'm trying to get on that. I, I seen Floyd Mayweather do that before. I was like, that's the coolest hell. So yeah, that's one of my goals. Um, but I'm gonna get the pack and I gotta pack all this shit up. Force everything in this suitcase that I did bring. Because my flight, I board at 11 o'clock. Cause I gotta get back to Atlanta cause I gotta handle something in the morning. I gotta go to my boy Tree court date. Shout out that boy Tree, man. I hope, I ain't gonna lie, I'm praying for the best, man. I ain't gonna cap. Cause it's just like the vibes ain't been the same since twin got locked up. It's just like, been straight BS. But, like I said, I got a, um, I actually was supposed to be out here another day, but they moved the date back, so I had to, you know what I'm saying, change my flight in, whatnot, because I got to be there. I'm going to be there, a thousand percent. I don't give a fuck if I bring, I got to bring my suitcase in the damn courthouse, nigga. I'm going to do that shit, because guess what? I got to be there. But, that's neither here nor there. That's going to wrap up my LA vlog. They left my damn socks on the thing. And I am not going to lie, bro. I feel like I'm getting sick, bro. This shit weird as fuck. Like, every last time I came to LA, I got sick as fuck. This time I'm out here, I feel like I'm getting sick. I don't know if it's the air. I don't know what the hell it is. But as soon as I go home, I'm taking hella medicine. This shit weird, though. It's probably the airplane. Because I know I sleep with my mouth open. And that's probably what it is. But I don't know. We're going to see. It's like I'm, 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 I feel a sore throat coming on some weird shit. That's going to wrap up today's vlog. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed the LA trip. I will see y'all when I get back to Atlanta. I'm going to get the pumping out content. And... I will be raffling off my track hawk, track hawk raffle details coming real, real soon. So, with that being said, stay tuned for that. But it's your boy Quan, Cozy Mike for the game, and I'm out.